guys, it's me, the mother effing Japanese doll, Frenchie, in the Frenchie's world. A video for who? A video for you guys. Yes, my videos will always be for you guys. You guys, so what you see in the, in the titles down below, I have, oh my gosh. I'll be right back. I forgot what this is called right here. I should be knowing with but this ain't the name of it right here but I'm going to show you this path so you guys can go get it yourself but I but this is not the one I'm eating but I'm just going to show you one of the ones that I have because the, the path is like deep down in the trash can and I'm not about to dig down there but I remember the name since I seen this one in my fridge. I am eating fortune, fortune soba, okay? Fortune soba, yes, and it's chicken flavor. But the, the funny thing is about this, it's not really chicken flavor at all. It's not, and yeah, and so this one is um a different brand right here. If you guys ever seen these at you know at Seafood City or anything of like that, or your Asian one any of your Asian local stores, yes, they have these in there. Yes, and yes, I'm eating the stir fry version. The soba, yes, and I got tofu scrambled eggs in a burrito form. If you can see that, look, look at that, look at that, right there, yes, yes, you guys, and I'm gonna get into this food after my prayers yes and before i get to this prayer please go down below and like share and subscribe and click that notification bell button so you guys can be notified at any given time whenever i upload a video to my channel so let's get into into this prayer and get down to this eating yes girl yes heavenly father Thank you for this food. Thank you for this day. Thank you for your time. Thank you for the food that I'm receiving, I shall say. And bless the people that's in hunger and need with food. And bless the people that need shelter with shelter. And just bless them both with the same on both sides. Food for the for the um for the people that need shelter and and shelter for the people that need food as well. And to show us the right path, the right path of joy, no bad vibes whatsoever. And please make this COVID, Corona, all of this go away. Please, 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 please. Yes, Jesus, yes. And yeah, through you, Jesus, amen. Yes, I'm, I'm telling you, a prayer is a prayer, yes, but I'm not the best at it. Who, who, what is the best of doing prayers? What, what is best? You know, so, anyways, but I did that. So, yes, you guys, you guys never had tofu scrambled eggs? You guys need to go try it out. I got this one homemade. Homemade, yes. Look at that. Look. Look at that. Yes, yes, yes. I had condiments on the side. Well, first, I have my water bottle. Yes. I have guacamole right here. Guacamole for my tofu scrambled eggs. I'm going to put it over here next to it. And then I have... Stop a deal for the tofu scrambled eggs. Put it over here too. I know you guys are saying, I know you guys are looking like tofu scrambled eggs. 
And you guys, and you had Asian food right here. This Japanese noodles right here. Yeah, I yes I do. And I have sriracha sauce. I wish I had um um what is it called um damn I forgot what it's called. Never mind. I can't even remember the name of it. And soy sauce. Yes, soy sauce. So, you guys, it took me forever to get this video together and start filming. It did. Like, I'm not even going to lie to you guys. My food sat there for like 30, 40 minutes. And I just want to go warm this up. Yes, I know. I should have had my camera and everything set up before I went to go cook. But it didn't cross my mind. It didn't. Mmm, this is good, this is really good, this tofu scrambled eggs in a, in a, in a, um, flour tortilla, but, a lot, oh, excuse me, a lot of people don't like tofu for some reason, I don't know why, people just don't, at first, at first, I didn't even like tofu at first. I remember five years ago, five years, wait, it's about to be six years, but five years ago, I did not like tofu whatsoever. I was like, oh, what the, what, the, what is this? And then I kept on eating it over and over and over, and then I started to eventually like it. Now, tofu don't have no flavor whatsoever on it. So you have to put spices and seasonings on it to get the flavor. So yeah. Oh, where's my napkin? I'll be right back. Okay, I got my napkin. I got my napkin. This right here. So, you guys, I have some good news coming up, but it's good news, but I'm just gonna see where it goes. I'm gonna see where it goes. So, so you guys, so next year, so next year, like in January, and so far on, however long this will go, my dad, he has a, um, a studio that he's making for creators. You know, like a filming photography, filming and photography studio. And it's going to be in my grandma's apartment where she used to live. Rest in peace to my grandma. Mm. So, yes, you guys. So, he's going to make a filming, editing, photography, all that for creators to go. And then my dad said, oh yeah, um, it's free for family, this and that, or whatever, and and you can bring people and friends with you, whoever, all that. So I'm like, okay. And then he told me to come out there to get some stuff done, and I was not going to pass up that. I'm not going to pass up it. So last month, me and my dad was talking on the phone, and I was telling him like what I want to do for my filming and then he said yeah just come out here and then he said you can come out here sooner than next year but i was like no i'm gonna just wait until next year so he said okay 
And then, yeah, so he's going to help me out with my filming and stuff. So, you guys, my YouTube is going to be the same but a lot different. I'm going to, my YouTube channel is going to be upgraded next year. Yes, you guys, I'm going to be in Los Angeles. I'm going to be in Los Angeles most of my days. Even though I live in Los, I mean, even though I live in, yeah, Las Vegas. Even though even though I live in Las Vegas, but majority of my days will be in Los Angeles next year. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. But I'm just being humble though at the same time. But then in between, I'm just going to see where it goes. Because, you guys, I'm not going to be making money right when I get out there. I got to put the effort in be committed put in those hours so yes oh it's sad to me see oil that's what i wish i had for for this right here the soba. I wish I had it for this soba right here. But it's alright. I don't have any right now. Let's give this a try. No, well, I already had this before. But let's give this one right here. You see how today's cooking went for this. I know you guys, I had this sitting out for like 30, 40 minutes and I just warmed this up. I have to. I know I should have got my um, equipment set up already. <sighs> but it is what it is. Oh yeah, I should have my 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 camera set up already and had this fresh, but it's still good. But it would have been a lot better being cooked fresh than warming it back up. But yeah, you guys. <sighs> it's crazy thing. Crazy, crazy, crazy thing. I was like telling people, you go vegan, you that that you can you can you can kill yourself going vegan. Well, no. Somewhat, yeah, but no, not really at all. Because, like, five days ago or four days ago, I was thinking, I was like, wait a minute. Cause I was watching um, Cheap, Ve Cheap Lazy Vegan, um, the YouTuber girl with, with the green hair that lives in Canada. I was watching her videos and and she was talking about how people would like tell her in the past like oh my god you're vegan like oh this and that and third or or she would go out and see people eat like steak pork chicken all of that type of stuff and she used to feel some type of way too but now over time it's just like if that's what you want to eat that's what you want to eat and this is what i eat and that's just what it is so 
I remember me saying when I was watching that and then something that came to me, I was like, I was like, wait, I do eat a lot of plant-based meals. I do. I eat a lot of plant-based meals. So when I first was a beginner, an average Joe, at becoming a vegan, my body wasn't used to it at all. That's why I was feeling kind of funny about it. My body wasn't used to it. It was something new to go on this path, this new journey, going vegan. But now that I think about it now, it's just my body wasn't used to it. That's just it. It's just my body wasn't used to it. And the more I kept on eating it and eating, eating, eating plant-based meals, food, etc. You guys, I am okay. I am fine. And then I do get full stuff off of it. Yes, I do. You guys, like, for me, like, I'm, I'm all three, but if you want to narrow it down, I'm just pescatarian, but I'm, I'm pescatarian, vegetarian, and a vegan, pescatarian, vegetarian, and a vegan, but all in all, if you narrow it all the way down to one, I'm basically pescatarian, pescatarian, yes, you guys. But um, but at the end of the day, if that's what you guys like to eat, like steak, chicken, pork, all of that, you know, lamb, just that's what you guys like to eat, you know, beef, if that's what you guys like to eat, eat it, because I have no say, so I just... Seeing what I've seen and it just changed me and this is who I am. This is me, Frank G, today, as of today. And I'm going on my sixth year being like, being like this. So you guys, um, yeah. And then like I said, my body was like, my body was just not used to going vegan in the beginning. You know, it just, my body wasn't used to it. And... Here I am now, still eating plant-based meals. <laughs> but yeah, you guys, I'm so excited. I'm trying to be humble about it. About what my dad is going to help me out on doing with my craft for this YouTube. And then many, many more too. Because there's other stuff that I'm going to be doing besides YouTube as well. There's going to be other things I'm going to be doing besides YouTube as well. Just stay tuned for it because I can't give out any more details. I cannot. Yeah, and then I had a friend too. You, you guys know that boy that was in my videos. Um, I told him to come with me. Come with me. Don't worry about it. I got you for next year because he does music. He does YouTube videos and he does music as well. He does music more than doing YouTube. But... He don't live here no more. He had left, so I had nothing to say with that or do with that. We don't even talk anymore. So it is what it is. I told him, come with me in Hollywood. You know, kind of, oh, I put it out there. I know I said LA, but I said exactly where I was going to be at. Okay. Anyways, it's going to be in Hollywood. That's where I'm going to be at in LA. Oops. Yeah, so, but he got up and left, so. Who am I to, like, run to back to the person and be like, come on, what are you doing? That's not, nope. Did you 
go off your own way and you do what you want to do. I'm going to stay focused on what I got locked down, set in stone, and go forward with it and not look back whatsoever. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, like... Oh my gosh, like for real, for real, like my dad is willing to help me out. And then another thing too, this is what I've been wanting to do. I told you guys this like, like two years ago, if you guys go back to my back in the day videos, I was telling you guys I want to get out there and go interview people in, in the community. And then this crazy thing is, there goes here goes the one spoiler for you guys that I'm gonna I'm gonna say. Yeah, my dad was like, oh, you can do you can do stuff for like the LGBTQ community. And I was like, I I was like this on the phone. I I was like this on the phone. Yeah, I was thinking that too. Cause if you guys know me from way back then, or you guys haven't, just go back like two years ago back and watch. I think I had like two videos of me explaining. That's what I want to do. So you guys, I, I went, so my dad was like, yeah, you can do stuff for the LGBTQ community. Like you can interview them or something like that. And I was like, what? Yes, I was thinking that too. I, I, I mean, I was like, I, I wanted to do that, but I just didn't have like the right space to do it. And then my dad was like, yeah, I, I, he was, my dad was like, yeah, I've been having that in mind and other stuff for LGBT community, community as well you could do stuff too and i was like yeah so that's just one part there's other stuff that i have going on for my craft yes the mother effing japanese doll period you just gotta stay tuned you just gotta stay tuned and wait period so yeah you guys um i'm excited i can't no oh. I'm I'm excited. And that boy that you see me do videos with, like that anniversary video of being friends. Now that's crazy. Now that's crazy. We did that video. We did that video together and he's not even here. But you know these noodles, they still it, I mean not they but I already know this. You can eat this. You can eat these noodles cold, but I don't like cold meals. But I'm just gonna have to deal with it right now. Yeah, you guys. Oh, I was moving around just to get this video rolling, running around. I need some water. I forgot where I was at. What was I talking about? I forgot what I was talking about. Oh my gosh. What was I talking about? See, if I would have went, if I would have went live for this mukbang, and ask you guys, I could ask you guys, where was I at? So you guys can refresh my mind, but <sighs> this is not a live video. Mm. I know I was talking about me going to Hollywood because I already spoiled that. I said, 
LA. I didn't want to say exactly where in LA, but I, I spoiled it and I said Hollywood. And then I said that my dad's gonna help me out. And I was talking about the LGBTQ community and how my dad brought up what I've been wanting to do, but out here in Vegas. But I guess it's not working so far for that. But so I'm gonna go to LA for that and do that. But I forgot exactly what part was I at. Damn. I don't know. I don't know. Uh -huh. I don't know. I hate when this happens. I got a brain freeze. Like, where was I at? But But yeah, y'all, this is, I'm just excited about next year and see where everything goes for next year and see if that could spark the way for me. Yes, you guys, to spark the way for me. And that reality show that I'm supposed to be on will be start will start filming in December. Can't tell you what that. But let me see where that goes too as well. Let me see where that goes as well. Let me see. I don't know. Let me see where that goes as well. See, I'm booking busy for next year. I am all the way booked and busy for next year. So, yeah. And to be honest, I like being like that. I like being busy, ready to knock things out, you know. I like to be booked and busy. Like for I like to be busy. Like oh I'm busy, busy. But I'm doing what I love to do. Yes. you guys to be honest I was gonna do this mukbang in my bedroom I have never did that ever you guys hear a noise in the background that's the washing machine and dryer going well I think now it's the dryer now but mind that if you can hear that I know I try to make it good for this video but it is what it is but anyways you guys so I was gonna do this video in my bedroom, but because my cousin was doing something in this room, and you know, that's not my, like my normal setup, but you know, I couldn't get it together to get the camera angle right to show me like how it is right now. So he had went off to go do something else so I told him I'm about to film in the production room. Yes. So here I am. Oh yeah, another thing too. 
I am back at it again with the mukbangs. Yes, where have I been with the mukbangs? I know. I am back. I am back at it again with the mukbangs. I miss doing mukbangs, to be honest. I do. I really do miss doing mukbangs. I do, I do, I do, I do. Oh, you guys, my nose is running for some reason. I don't know why. You guys, cooking food is one of my favorite hobbies. Cooking food is one of my favorite hobbies of all time. My sister told me, um, one of my sisters told me that I used to live with, and um, two years ago, back two years ago in 2018, she had told me, oh, um, you should go to school for cosmetology because you like to cook. And I was like, um, I, I, at that time I was like, yeah, I should, huh? I was looking into it, but never went fully forward with it at all. Never did because, I mean, I like cooking food, but that's my biggest thing cooking food but i see myself doing videography a lot more like before i wasn't even like that before i was like really trying to be like i was really trying to be like a like a hip-hop dancer well not just a hip-hop dancer i want to be like being the dancing industry learn all the dances and then i want to be a r&b slash pop artist but you know that had turned a uh, turn that had turned another direction for me and here I am doing um mukbangs for you guys and doing my reaction videos and doing vlogs get ready with me hauls pranks I don't really do pranks that much so but pranks you know, doing makeup. I ha I haven't did a makeup tutorial yet, but I did a lot of makeup in my get ready. And then on top of that, only had two get ready videos. Oh, and then and then I do like my my um motivational videos too as well and then i do like my review videos of like what i'm what i'm taking for for my body and stuff like that but like i said i only had two get ready videos with me one i had up on my channel and then i took it down but it was too much information i was giving out in that video so now it bring it narrows it narrows down to only one get ready video on my channel. I'm gonna have more and more and more. Okay, it, it's coming. It's coming in the near future. But yeah, you guys. But besides that, my YouTube channel is gonna be 
it's, it's gonna be the same, but totally different at the same time. It's gonna be more. It's gonna be more professionalized. More next year. Because with me, I want a team. I want a, I want a team to help my brand. I want my team to help my brand to help them. You know? Like, I'm not here just for me. I'm here for all of us. You know? Hold me on with my brand for it to help you at the same time. You know? And I'll be telling people. I be telling a lot of people, like, for real, for real. I be telling people about certain things I, I have going in my life. I be telling them, like, hey, um, I have this going on, I have that going on. You say, link up with me or, or, or do this with me, you know, do this with me, same thing, linking up, you know, to do this or do that. And people would just be walking away from it. And I just be like, wow, you guys are really walking away from this. That will better you in life. We will put you in a different, a different, a good, a different good space in life where you don't have to worry or anything. I'm not going to say worry, but like it will level you in life, you know, but people would be walking away and I'd be like, and then when I go off and go do it, and they be looking back at it, and they be like, oh my gosh, and this and that, da 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 I be like, I told you, but you wanna walk away. I can't go back and grab you. I'm already moving forward. Nothing I can help with you now, you know? So I just, you know, oh my nose. Oh my gosh. Sorry, you guys. Sorry, sorry. But I be trying to tell people, like, look, listen. You know, I tell people. I tell a lot of people. I tell a lot of friends and people I used to be friends with. You know, I be telling them. I be like, look. I be like, look. You don't get nobody like me. You don't get nobody like me ever, ever. You don't get nobody like me. And when they see me doing what I had said I was going to do, and they be always running back like, oh my God, girl, this and that and that. Like, let me come through. Like, no, I told you this in the beginning. I told you this in the beginning. I can't go back and go grab you. I'm too, not like, there'll be times where I'll be too far in already to go back and get you and I can't. Or I already went through that door already and I can't go back and grab you. You should have listened to me in the beginning. Like, you know the things that I'd be doing in my life. Like, what? It is what it is. I told that one boy, and you guys see that I did with the one, um, well, I'm not gonna say that boy, I'm gonna just say his name. I don't care. I'm gonna just say his name, I'm gonna just say Bodak. Yes, you guys, like, I told him, come with me to Hollywood. You know, come out there. Most of most of most of my days will be out there, and we can get this this going with our crafts and what we love to do in life. Let's go! And he dipped off, so he went his own way. So best of luck to him. Oh my God. You guys, you guys are probably like, ew, tofu. No, like, honestly, honestly, tofu is 
Good. Mm-hmm. You just gotta use the right spices. You gotta use the right spices and and the and the right seasoning. That's all. Nothing more, nothing less. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. You guys with noodles, I don't like getting like 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 a lot of noodles at once. So I'm gonna just let that sit for a minute until I get until I wanna go back to it after I'm done taking bites of this um tofu scramble egg burrito. But yeah, you guys, that one video that I have up that I said I have something coming. And I was talking about a podcast. I want I want to do that still, but I'm on this new path right now. Where I, where I, where I got this vision on um, where I can see myself going to. Like, even with the podcast, I could deal with that too. I could do that too as well, but... Mm, I'm going to just go on this new path that I have going. That I have right now that is set in stone for next year. That I'm so excited for. You guys stay tuned. Yes. But, you guys, <sighs> you guys, I know I'm back at it again with the mukbang videos. Stay tuned for more. Stay tuned for more other videos. And I'm going to end it off right here because I'm pretty full. I'm not stuffed, but I am full. And I'm going to stop right here. So if you guys like this video and you guys want to see any more videos of me doing this or any many other videos that you guys like to see and you guys have not seen me ever in your life and you're like, hmm, what's this video about? And you clicked it on YouTube and you watch things, you know, and you see that it's very interesting. Oh, excuse me. You see that is very interesting. And you guys would like to see more and more and more to give to you guys. Well, please go down below and like, share, and subscribe. And click that notification bell button so you guys can be notified at any given time. Oh, wait. And comment, comment, comment. Comment down below. Mm. Peace.